Good evening. We would like to welcome you to Cesar E. Chavez High School Senior Award Ceremony. It fills us with a great deal of pride to be honoring these seniors here today. We would like to personally thank all of our scholarship donors for your commitment to Cesar E. Chavez High School's students and educational programs. We would also like to thank the parents and the staff for their commitment to our students. It is through your commitment and dedication that we are able to have events like this to acknowledge the achievements and accolades of our students. Buenas tardes. Nos gustaría darle la bienvenida a la ceremonia de premios de estudiantes del último año de la Escuela Secundaria César E. Chávez. Nos llena de orgullo estar honrando a estos próximos graduados aquí hoy. Nos gustaría agradecer personalmente a todos los donantes de becas por su compromiso con los estudiantes y los programas educativos de la Escuela Secundaria César E. Chávez. También nos gustaría agradecer a los padres y al personal por su compromiso con nuestros estudiantes. Es a través de su compromiso y dedicación que podemos tener eventos como este para reconocer los logros y elogios de nuestros estudiantes. A special thank you to our counseling department, Mr. Garza, Ms. De Leon, Ms. Mendoza, and Mr. Hernandez for helping guide our students through their high school career and putting this special event together. Class of 2020, we thank you for your hard work and commitment to excellence, to the hard work of your parents, and also the hard work of the teachers. Before we begin, we would like to start by thanking some key individuals who have a desire to see these young men and women be successful for years to come. First, we have our superintendent, Mr. Jason Garcia, and our board of trustees, Mr. Lionel Reyna, president, Mr. Arthur Menderes, clerk, Mr. Arnold Morrison, member, Ms. Eloise Carrillo, member, and Mr. Jesus Cardenas, member. Finally, the reason we are here tonight our students. Our students continue to distinguish themselves, validate what we do, and leave a lasting legacy for generations to come. They continue to achieve individually and as a school. Good evening, students, parents, and distinguished guests. My name is Raquel Bersanio. I'm Jeffrey. I'm Richard. And, and we, we are CSEA, CSEA Chapter, Chapter 79. 79. Tonight we come to you with our scholarship recipients for the Classified Schools Employees Association Chapter 79. On behalf of our members, it gives us great gratitude to present the following students with the scholarship. Chelsea Laricio, Andrew Haro, and Samantha Ordonez. On behalf of our members, congratulations to the graduating class of 2020. Hello and welcome to the awards assembly at Cesar Chavez High School and to the two winners of the Delano Youth Foundation Scholarships, Kamit Sahoja and Monica Gonzalez. They were selected on the basis of their academic records as, as well as their activities at Cesar Chavez High School and their service to the community. And uh, they both were excellent uh, choices from Cesar E. Chavez High School. Delano Youth Foundation has given these scholarships for several years, two at each of the public high schools in Delano. And since the early uh, 1960s, the Youth Foundation has contributed anywhere from seven to $9,000 per year to the uh, organizations and youth programs and uh, youth activities in individuals who need financial assistance as well as scholarships in recent years. Congratulations, Ms. Sahota and Ms. Gonzalez. I'm Mrs. Salazar, counselor at Delano High School. First of all, I would like to congratulate the class of 2020. I will be presenting the Juan Carlos Salazar Memorial Scholarship to a graduating senior from Cesar Chavez High School. Juan Carlos Salazar, my brother-in-law, was the youngest member in a family of 10. He attended Delano High School freshman year, then transferred to Cesar Chavez High School in 2003 when it first opened its doors. There, he completed his sophomore through senior year, which made him part of the first graduating class of 2006 at CCHS. While maintaining his academics as a scholar athlete, Juan Carlos participated in football and track. His career goal was to earn a college degree. 
However, in 2008, Juan Carlos suffered a fatal car accident while vacationing in Mexico. For that reason, my family and I would like to support a student in achieving his academic goal of earning a degree. On behalf of the Salazar family, I would like to recognize Julio Ballesteros as a recipient of the Juan Carlos Salazar Memorial Scholarship. Hello, my name is Frank Ramirez. I am the Executive Director of Youth to Leaders Education Foundation. It is with great pleasure that I am here today to award a scholarship to a very deserving student. Each year, Youth to Leaders Education Foundation partners with Migrant Education Region 14 in awarding a scholarship to the Migrant Student of the Year. We like to continue encouraging more students to continue on to college by helping them financially. It's with great pleasure that I'm here to recognize a student that not only has successfully been the student of the year for Region 14, but also shares the same mission of Youth to Leaders, which is to help kids access and succeed in completing a post-secondary education. Jesley Rendon, we look forward to continuing our partnership with you and hopefully partnering to help more kids succeed as you become a counselor and reach your goals. Hello Titans, this is Staff Sergeant Cruz from the U.S. Army Office in Delano. First of all, I would like to say thank you for all the support to the faculty team, the counseling team, athletics, ASB, and everybody else that helped us throughout the school year. I would also like to recognize two individuals that got selected by the school to receive the U.S. Army Reserve National Scholar Athlete Award. These are Al Hassan and Isabel Robles. Congratulations. This not only shows that you are great athletes, but also great students by balancing your performance on the court and off the court. I would also like to take this time to congratulate the graduating class of 2020. I wish you guys the best of luck. Continue to stay resilient. I know you guys can get through this and stay Army strong. ASB director at Cesar Chavez High School, and I'd like to take this time to recognize an extraordinary group of student leaders who have made a tremendous impact on creating a positive campus culture at CCHS. This group of students have spent countless hours planning and promoting student events and activities for our school, and they did such an amazing job. I am so, so proud of them. It is my pleasure to recognize the following senior students for their exemplary leadership. Alyssa Rivera, Carlos Zapata, Harneet Sahota, Denise Vega, Annabelle Herrera, and Angel Morales. Thank you so much for your hard work and service at CCHS and congratulations to you for your accomplishments and best of luck on your future endeavors. We are so proud of you and we know you will do great. Thank you. Hi everyone, it's me, Ms. Dow. I am the FBLA advisor, and I'm here to recognize a few of my FBLA members. Um, I do want to give a shout out to all of my FBLA members, especially my seniors. Um, you guys have done such a great job in making sure FBLA is one of the stronger organizations on campus. And to the individuals I'm recognizing today, thank you, thank you, thank you for going over and beyond. Thanks. Thank you to our FCCLA senior members from baked potato sales to chapter meetings, to leadership workshops, to competitions. You all did a wonderful job 
of representing our organization. Thank you so much. Hi everyone, I am Ms. Dow and I'm here to recognize Samantha Ledesma, Marianne Cardenas, and Madison Mendoza. They've been part of the Titan Year Grapevine publication for the last four years. And because of their hard work and dedication, they're being honored with the publication cord. Thank you again. Hi, my name is Susan Zamora, I'm the senior class president. I'd like to take this time to recognize a teacher who has served as an inspirational and motivational role model for our class. This particular teacher who was selected by our class as one of the most supportive, encouraging, and committed teachers has made a lasting impact on many of us. On behalf of the senior class of 2020, it gives me with great pleasure to recognize our most respected teacher of the class of 2020, Mr. Lenz. Thank you for all your support. Hey, what's up, Building Skills? This is Mr. Duran. I just want to go ahead and congratulate you guys on completing your two-year program under the Building and Construction Trades. These past two years have consisted of many field trips, many projects, from something as small as a little birdhouse to a picnic table, all the way up to the tiny house. I just want to say that I'm proud of you guys. I wish you guys the very best in the near future. I hope you guys really learn something that you can apply to later in life. If you guys ever need anything from me, you know where I'm at, you know how to contact me. Stay safe, stay positive. Hi, I'm Esteban Garza, Business Management Pathway Teacher. Today, I'd like to recognize the following five seniors who have taken both business management courses and have successfully completed the pathway. Jose Ayon, Fidel Garcia, Loli Mercado, Cassandra Miranda, and Maria Ramirez. They have been amazing in my class the last two years. Thank you. Hi, this is Mrs. Alvarez, and I am the Education Pathway Instructor at Cesar Chavez High School. I'd like to take this time to congratulate my seniors enrolled in Education Pathway for completion of the theory and practicum portion of the course. Congratulations, and I am so proud of you. Congratulations to those of you who completed the Food Service and Hospitality Pathway. It was a joy to teach you in both Foods 1 and Foods 2. I wish you the absolute best for your future. Congratulations. Yo, what's up, CC? Yo, man, shout out, man, to all the music CTE completers. It's been a great ride, man. I've appreciated, man, your music. You've been awesome. I expect, man, just great performances out of you in the future. And uh, just keep on keeping up, man, because uh, you guys have a lot of potential and a lot of talent. So uh, it's been great. And again, man, congratulations to you, man, completing that, man. Right on. You guys are the first completers in history, man, of CC Music. So again, congrats. Hi everyone, it's Ms. Dow here. I'm here to recognize the Software and Systems Development Career Pathway Completers, also known as Multimedia CCTV. Uh, thank you to everyone in the class. Uh, you did such great, awesome work. I look forward to all the things that you do in the future. Thank you and congratulations.